You're probably asking yourself, who is that dude on the uh, on the screen? It's me. I know you don't believe me. I got a haircut. My beard's long. It's been like three weeks. But I promise, I am back, and I have a lot of videos coming out soon. So you should rejoice. <sighs> it's also New Year, so Happy New Year, everyone. 2019. Let's hope uh, we have better luck with shoe releases in 2019, because last year was... <clears throat> um... First video I'm going to release, though, is not a shoe, shoe video. I actually got the first in the new series of the Fallout Loot Crates. Surprisingly, I didn't I didn't sign up for them, and then I didn't get charged for it, and they just showed up. I was like, huh. We'll do an opening anyway. Um, so I'm kind of excited. Um, the last one, a couple of the last ones were eh, so I'm hoping this one kind of makes up for it a little bit. But I guess we'll just see. So let's just get right into it and just kind of... Open this bad boy up and see what's in here. Ooh. Alright, uh, I guess we'll start off with... <laughs> um, there is some... If it focuses... It's gonna be a pain in the butt today, isn't it? Bruh. Just focus on what I want you to. There we go. Uh, some Fallout salt and pepper shakers. Which I actually might use these because we might need some new ones. They're little mini nukes. That's pretty cool. Um, obviously, if you're an adult, it's cooler. I guess I'm an adult, and I. <sighs> Damn. That's why they're cool. I'm an adult. Lame. Um, the pin for this time is the Adamantium Skeleton because this is the nuked themed crate. So, Adamantium Skeleton is. Um, you take more damage. To limbs and stuff. Actually, that might not be. It looks like it's Admin Team Skeleton. I don't know if it is or not. But that's what it looks like. So that's what I'm gonna go with. Um. We got some like giant scorpion bottle opener. I don't really know what this is. Unless it's like a Kaiser's Legion thing. Hold on, I'll, I'll figure that out. Um, it looks like we got part of a build a figure, the uh, torso. So let's, I mean, I don't really know what to. I guess I'll just show you that part. Cause I don't really know what to show you. So we got that part today. I'll open it up and show you guys that way you guys can see what it actually looks like instead of just me being like, we get a torso. Ooh, this is cool. And then we got a Fat Man replica. I'll be able to pull that out and set that up on my desk and stuff so I can be reminded of Fallout every day, even though I'm already reminded of Fallout. I don't know if you can see any of that. If you zoom in on your screen, a lot of that's Fallout stuff. Um, ra oh, Rad Scorp. <coughs> it's a Rad Scorpion. Bottle opener. That makes sense, I guess. Yeah. Um, it's a Liberty Prime build a figure torso. So that's cool. That's kind of exciting. It's a Liberty Prime, which means um, we'll have a full full standing Liberty Prime at the end of uh, this run of boxes, which that's pretty cool because I hope it stands better at least because I can't even display the freaking power I'm rolling because he just falls over in like two seconds because he's so heavy. Um, all in all, not too bad. Um, let's look and see what all these look like opened up. <laughs> I mean, these are pretty cool. Little salt shakers. I can't really, it doesn't seem like you can really hold a bunch in there. But, you know, the idea is nice, I guess. Um, you already saw the pen, the bottle opener. Let's get the Fat Man replica out. Let's see what that looks like. I hope you're making me very ow. You're making me very happy. Haha. 
Alright, that's pretty cool too. I'm not even gonna lie. I don't know if you can... Don't focus on my face. I don't want you to see my face anymore. I want you to see this. That's pretty cool. The mini nuke's like a separate part in there, so you can kind of like take it out if you want to. That's pretty cool. And I guess we'll take the torso out, even though I can't do anything with it. And he's got a mini nuke on his back, too. Ooh, this is heavy. I feel like this is gonna have a hard time. Okay, don't auto focus on my hand, please. No, stop it. Stop focusing on my hand. <sighs> he's really heavy, but he's actually really detailed, which is kind of cool. So I'm, I'm hoping, he's a mini nuke. I'm hoping he's not too heavy to even stand, because then it's like that's two figures they've given you where they can't even stand up by themselves. So it's like, what's the point? Like, I should be able to. It should be able to stand on its own. If I want to display it, I shouldn't have to like, worry about it freaking falling and stuff. But yeah, I, not too bad. Not too bad. I think it makes up a little bit from the other ones. Especially towards the end. Because like I said, some of those ones towards the end were just kind of... Um, they were not that good at all. So I'm glad they kind of stepped their game up a little bit. Gave you some stuff that you can actually use. And some stuff that looks good displayed and doesn't fall over. Um, and then we're getting in Liberty Prime build a figure that hopefully <laughs> can stand on its own. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like on it. Let me know why you liked it in the comment section below. If you uh, like Fallout crates or you think they're kind of a waste of money, just go ahead and let me know. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to stay up to date on all the videos I'm about to release. I've got three pairs of shoes. You're I, we cooked. We cooked over Christmas break. Um, you guys are gonna be pretty excited about two of them at least. I think all three of them are cool, but. We'll see. Um, thanks for watching, guys, though, and uh, Happy New Year's. Happy Merry Christmas, if I didn't say that already. And until the next time, peace out, guys.